Hi my loves, welcome back to the Stars Cartel channel. If you don't know, I am Star, and the message I have for you today is open the book. The scripture comes from Isaiah 15, 1 through 5, a prophecy against Moab. Ar in Moab is ruined, destroyed in the night. Kur in Moab is ruined, destroyed in the night. Dibon goes up to its temple, to its high places to weep. Moab wells over Nebo and Mediba. Every head is shaved and every beard is cut off. In the streets, they wear sackcloth. On the roofs and in public squares, they all will. Prostrate with weeping. Heshbon and Alilai cry out. Their voices are heard all the way to Jahaz. Therefore, the armed men of Moab cry out, and their hearts are faint. My heart cries over Moab. Her fugitives flee as far as Zor. As far as Iglath, Shelishia. They go up to the hill, they go up the hill to Luhith, weeping as they go. On the road to Horonane, they lament their destruction. With this message, God is saying, for somebody, um, somebody has been going through a lot of torment. Somebody has had a lot of destruction in their life. Somebody has been going through a lot of heartache, a lot of pain. And God is saying, open up. The book, open the book, I'll read the book, read it, read the word of God. Sometimes when I'm going through it, I literally ask God to give me a verse and just open the book and it goes to a verse that's perfect to whatever I'm going through at that moment. And with this message, God is saying, your destruction is coming from your refusal to hear the word of God, your refusal to listen to the word of God, your refusal to listen to what God has been telling you. You are insisting on doing everything that God has asked you not to do and turn around and say, well, I don't understand why everything is going bad. Why do you keep ignoring God's advice? Um, I asked somebody who used to give my friends advice. I can say that it is nothing more annoying than somebody asking you for advice, ignoring your advice and going and doing whatever they felt like doing in the first place. And it just makes you feel like, then why did you ask me anyways? And that's pro I feel like that's how God is feeling right now. Because you keep coming to God for advice. He tell you what to do. And instead of doing what he said to do, you do the complete opposite. And then you wonder why everything is going up in flames. God says, stop playing with me okay stop playing with god now you can play with man but don't play with god okay you can play with man because man is gonna feel like okay whatever that it is what it is but when it comes to god when you go to god for instruction when you go to god for help and god gives you the help that you asked for and instead of listening to the advice that god gave you you ignore it and do whatever you was gonna do in the first place anyways then now now, now you have to deal with God's vengeance. You have to deal with God's judgment. You have to deal with however God is feeling about that because you did not do this to just every your friend. You didn't do it to your friend up the street. You did this to God. You are ignoring God and God told you what he told you for a reason. That's the message, okay? God said, open the Bible, read it. Talk to God. And when you talk to God, don't just hear what he has to say and then ignore it. Hear what he has to say and put forth the effort to um to use this in your life, okay? Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe.